soaking up the pre-match atmosphere here as we wait for things to get started. Won't be long now before we get through the formalities. A warm welcome one and all. And here we have Sevilla against Real Betis. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Begley. He's gone for it! Goal! Sevilla! And what a start! Ruben Castro with a shot! And he just whacks it away. Now the pass. Ib Ibrahimovic hits it! Oh, and the finish! It's there! And they are disappearing out of sight! Sevilla get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0 this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Ibrahimovic plays a clever pass. Pablo Sarabia! Well, he should have done better and he knows it. It's still a really good effort though. And he's cut it out. Now it's it's Ibrahimovic! More and more and more and more! They are running right! Big chance! There is the half-time whistle. As easy as one, two, three. It really has been that straightforward halfway through the match, but very little to suggest that much will change over the second half. Peter, do I really need to say anything, or can I simply refer you to the scoreline? Sevilla, three goals to the good after a really excellent first half that's been intriguing to watch. Plenty of highlights to show you during the break.
So off we go once more. He's tried one. Joaquin. Chop shot at goal. And he should have made it four. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Shapes the shoots. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. They've managed to get it away. Zaza. Sevilla, oh, the most prolific team in the league this season. And it's Teo. Going through. Now he's wondering who wants it. Good save, really well read. Oh, top draw save from the keeper. And it's Shaka. So not long left in this now. Sevilla are oh, this close to a place in the Champions League. And it's Ruben Castro. Pablo Sarabia. Campbell gets it. Is it in? He's had a shot. It's in. And that's that. Sevilla were irresistible here. Dominant, utterly ruthless. Only ever one result. A comfortable win. Thoughts on what we've just seen? Sevilla made their intentions clear that nothing else but a win would do.
the opening fixture of the business end of the Champions League. It is cutthroat now. A single error could spell the end of the road. This is where the stakes get higher for all those teams remaining. Knockout football from here. Paris Saint-Germain line up in a 4-4-2. It's a well-employed system that demands certainty from the white men. They have to forage and work back. And we're underway. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Well, it's a tough one, but I'll go for Danny Alves just to point out that he masquerades as a fullback. You know, he'll spend so much of the game. Heads it! Fair attempt, just the wrong outcome. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. Yeah, this has been pretty decisive, no doubt as to who the better side is. Neymar, Kuzawa, Adrian Silva, still goalless, Ibrahimovic gets it, and now what? That is terrific skill. Oh, has a swing at it! Goal, Sevilla! And Sevilla score first. Sevilla draw first blood here. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Adrian Silva. Oh, flags up. It doesn't take much sometimes, Peter. He has to adjust a little mistimed run. Battles to win it back. Referee's had a look. And he's blown his whistle for half-time. Well, there we are. Off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Sevilla leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break.
the start of another 45 minutes. Sevilla going well here and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Cavani plays it into the channel. Aimed long and direct. Paris Saint-Germain are definitely going about this the right way. Oh, this isn't the goes for goal! Oh, I like the little feint he came up with to produce the effort. Very, very tidy. We have got changes here from both sides, in fact. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and what they've got to realise, Peter, is... And the finish! Motta goes looking. And it's Kozawa. Just brushed off the ball there. Cordoba. Looks like a good ball through. He's got away. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Thiago Motta. It is just a question of running down the clock now. Cordoba. And there goes the final whistle. Sevilla sitting pretty. Big favourites for the quarterfinals now after winning the first leg away from home. Yeah, clean sheets and hard grind will help you go places and they have a resolve that'll envy many.
Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. And our live game is Levante against Sevilla. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beglin. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. and I've been hit by it too. And that gets things running. Sevilla were imperious when the two sides last met. Has a hit! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. And it's Pazzini. So what now? It's a fine run and he's happy to keep going. That's gone a long way up and away. Pazzini, good challenge, he just stood firm. Tries a through, shapes the shoots. And he's there to make a great save. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Plays it out to the wing. He's hits one! Goal! Sevilla! And Sevilla score first. Sevilla take the lead. Still a fragile lead though. They can't afford to sit on this. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. It's a loose ball. So they got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. We hit half time. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, that certainly pleased the fans, and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline. The question is now can they protect it? Sevilla come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting, and there is certainly plenty for us to chew on during the break. That's the start of another 45 minutes. Hits it! In it goes! Two up and threatening to pull clear! Sevilla grab a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Now the pass. 
going through and it's hoisted clear hoists it high Silva is effectively being marked out of the game here can he finish? oh the keeper's done ever so well well that was high class goalkeeping there towering header oh and he's got good distance who's chasing? he's come loose that's the throw Sevilla have played a lot of games just lately. Romario! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Has a swing at it! Oh, it looked like 3 0 for Sh Header! Presswell plays it backwards and they'll try again. Great build up, it all deserved a better ending. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. For Tunis. And it's Pazzini. Out to the flank. Cut out in the nick of time. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Sevilla come away with the win. A job really well done in all departments. A real sum of the parts team effort. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Sevilla simply imposed their strength from start to finish and this became as predictable as predicted. So just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening. Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be underway. The teams then, sporting Gijon against Sevilla. 
My name's Peter Drury, and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Beglin. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. A win. That is what's needed here in order for the champions elect to become the champions. Is this to be the day when the wait finally ends? Can he score? Goal! Sevilla! Could that be the start of something big? Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Sevilla take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Yeah, I think for them to get their noses in front away from home is brilliant, but these home fans will demand a response. Hits one! It's a goal! And they are disappearing out of sight! Sevilla grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Sevilla come up with yet another first-half goal. Ibrahimovic! What a rocket! That is special! A finish right from the top draw! Unbelievable. Hot knife through butter. They have... That'll be the final action of the first half. As easy as one, two, three. It really has been that straightforward halfway through the match, but very little to suggest that much will change over the second half. Peter, do I really need to say anything, or can I simply refer you to the scoreline? Sevilla have established themselves in a position of absolute supremacy. An action-packed 45 minutes, and they have raced into a three-goal lead. And we're already back on the way here. Changes made by neither side, from what we understand. That's a towering header! Shoots! Loose ball, who's going to get there? Hits one! Saved! That's good keeping. It was more possible. He's gone for it! And he should have made it four. Header! No, he didn't quite meet it right. Oh, he really wanted that. Well, Peter, I think it's fairly obvious he's one of the biggest influencers out there. Goes for it! And more, and more, and more! Results no longer in doubt. It's just about how many. He's had a shot. Sticks it away. And again, they pile on the misery. Sevilla totally rampant here. Played back in. He could have been in, just needed a... Is it in? Ibrahimovic! It could only be him! And still they continue with the onslaught. Shot at goal! Back of the net! Well, surely that completes the demolition if it hadn't occurred already. The referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle.
I think we're just about ready to get going here. A warm welcome to you wherever you are in the world. And here we have Sevilla against Malaga. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. As you can see, we've already started here. The defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go and shoot! They've scored! Listen, the big names earn their reputations for precisely the reason we've just seen. They have a habit of making their presence felt, and here we are, early stages. He struck one, and he looks hungry for more. Oh, high quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Romario! Back of the net! Hot knife through butter, they have done it again! Hits one! Oh, that's brilliant! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! And they are disappearing out of sight! Has a hit, and more, and more, and more. And already they're looking to run away with it. Sevilla totally rampant here. Goes long. Romario! It's there. All too easy. They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. Sevilla. The referee brings the first half to a close. Well, that flew by. It was breathless stuff. It's been one-way traffic here after the first 45 minutes. A relentless barrage that looks set to continue. Well, I would think this one is possibly over as a contest. They know they've already reached cruise control, and it's a case of the right game management to take it from here. Sevilla dishing out what has been nothing short of an absolute mauling. The game is surely already in the bag, but there is plenty for the boys to talk about during half-time. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. It is a corner, so he's got himself a goal. A massive leap! Trying to get there. Oh, full-blooded challenge, and it had to be. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Aimed long and direct. Out to the left it goes. Malaga were impressive in their last outing and brilliantly orchestrated by the manager. Well, Peter, you just can't argue with the substitutions. They were spot on and the timing of each were, were perfect. Shapes the shoots! No mistake! And again, they pile on the misery. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Up to meet it! Cresswell. Romario, looks like a good... Pablo Sarabia! Good clearance and very necessary. Sevilla, and time is up. Sevilla, a class apart, opponents torn apart. They are comprehensive winners. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Sevilla simply made their superiority count. They found cruise control quite early and, and didn't need to go to turbo. So many thanks to Jim Beglin. That's all we have time for. Good evening to you.
Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. And our live game is Sevilla against Paris Saint-Germain. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beglin. Thanks for that, Peter. And may I say a big hello to everyone. And so the distinctive sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem. So it's away we go then. Sevilla bring a big chance. Goal, Sevilla! That's the start dreams are made of and that has to give them great confidence for what's to come. Sevilla take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. It's being played forward. Massive leap! What about it? Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. Sevilla grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Cavani clearly is miffed having made the run and not get picked out. Ibrahimovic hurls himself at it. He's done very well to get to that. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Well, that's one way of trying to make... Can he finish? It's anyone's ball. Well, that'll be the final action of the first half. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? Sevilla in control at half-time, 2-0. And we are already promptly back on the way. Looks to clip it forward. He's gone for it! They are rampant! Surely now, beyond all doubt. Done very well to intervene. Out to the left it goes. He'll have a dip. Sanya goes looking. La Sanatiara steered out wide. Lovely bit of skill. Forward it goes. Over to the left. And the flat. The shot's on. Great football. Shot and save. Sevilla are looking quite mean on the counter and combating that requires even more meanness. Dani Alves plays it forward. Just, it's Ibrahimovic! Ibrahimovic! It could only be him! Results no longer in doubt. It's just about how many. Hits one! And he's missed it. Oh, he really wanted that. Well, Peter, I think it's fairly obvious. He's one of the biggest influences out there. Ibrahimovic! Close, but time for no more. The whistle has gone. First hurdle cleared. On to the next one. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Sevilla won thanks to a, a disciplined game plan. Homework provided the groundwork and it exploited an obvious central weakness.
Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be underway. The teams then, Rayo Vallecano against Sevilla. I'm Peter Drury and joining me here, our expert Jim Beglin. Well thanks Peter, there's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium and I've been hit by it too. So it's away we go then. Plays a clever pass. Trustwell goes looking, plays it out to the flank. How about it? It's there! Listen, the big names earn their reputations for precisely the reason we've just seen. They have a habit of making their presence felt. And here we are, early stages. He struck one and he looks hungry for more. Sevilla are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Sevilla take the early advantage. It's a good foot in there. Well, he was thinking about headlines, I'm sure, but he ought to focus more on, on breaking lines. Hits one! He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Strong punch. Well, the ball's come loose and the chain looking to shoot. Another save. Hits it! And that has been clubbed away. Pablo, Pablo Sarabia! It's a goal! All too easy. They are in danger of disappearing out of sight. Sevilla have a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. Is it in? They are rampant. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. The understanding between those two plays a big part in that and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. As easy as one, two, three. It really has been that straightforward halfway through the match, but very little to suggest that much will change over the second half. This looks well and truly sewn up already, Peter, but please feel free to forget what I've just said if there's a spectacular turnaround. Sevilla, three goals to the good after a really excellent first half that's been intriguing to watch. Plenty of highlights to show you during the break.
action is back on the way. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities.